Hi, this is Mr. Capper. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to 3D model practice part number two, which is a red L on the introduction to Onshape video. So open up the part we already started in the prior video, which was this practice parts one, two, and three. We're gonna create this red L right within this same document. So click on front. If you can't get to that, remember you can zoom and everything. Hit the pencil symbol. We're gonna use the line tool this time. And before I showed you, in order to get the straight on view of this perpendicular, I used the view cube. Another way is two fingers, view normal to sketch plane. And I like to lock this view so it doesn't rotate. Make sure your line tool is still selected. Sometimes students slip up and they'll touch something and deactivate it. So you know what tool's activated right now. It's what's highlighted the line tool. So I'm gonna zoom in. And once again, I'm gonna hold my finger down to snap to this axis. I'm gonna try to put this part pretty close to the part I just did. Not right on top of it, but fairly close. So finish off the shape. You're then gonna make it, uh, and you gotta dimension it. So pencil symbol, dimension. I'm gonna do all my widths first. I'm gonna start from the left edge each time. Common reference point, even when we're doing um, the video. Then I'll do all my heights. Yeah, so common reference point, we do that for sketches and 3D model. Remember, if you make a mistake, you can always hit the undo button, which I just did. So I'll hit the undo button to go back. And notice it got deselected, so I need to hit that dimension symbol again. So sometimes you're gonna slip and accidentally touch something you didn't mean to. All right, we're fully dimensioned. We got two widths, two heights. Hit the check mark that you're done with sketch three, and then Go to the sphere, extrude. It wants you to choose a shape. Notice it says select a face or sketch to extrude, which is that. Go to depth and make that three quarters of an inch. Check mark, it did it, good. Check mark again to finish off this extrusion. And then the last step is I want you to make this red. So three dots. Uh, appearance. Notice that was on part two that I, I hit the three dots. Kind of hard to see there. Um, appearance. And then let's do our red. Check mark to finish it off. And then looks really good. So now you're done with part two. Let me know if you have any questions at all.